is called Blackface. What do you think Those about this? That's how it is served. Yes. That's a real thing. It's uh, real. It's, it's no it, joke. It's no joke. It's on television and billboards in the Netherlands. Um, I really didn't think that they were like that there. Because like my friend goes there often and she always says that like it's a really like fun and free place. I think they were like the first country to pass like same sex marriage or yeah. something. Like they're really cool like that. So now that I know that, it's a little weird. Changes my perspective a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Right. I'm surprised that's in the Netherlands. Yeah, because the. the mm -hmm. I'm oh, well, sorry. I've, I've been there, so like I saw it. It seemed pretty. Like people didn't seem so uh, less than that. So Progressive. Was, yeah. Yeah, so we have this uh, party in the Netherlands. Okay. Uh, it's similar to uh, Christmas with okay. a guy with a beard okay. giving the children presents. Mm -hmm. And I'm uh, right now uh, showing you a picture. I feel like I've heard of it. What is it called? Uh, yeah, it's Santa Claus. Yes. Um, and he has a help, uh, someone who helps mm -hmm. him, a uh, little guy. And just as Santa Claus has these angels, yeah, yeah, elves, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, but in the Netherlands we call them, uh, it's really slow my internet. Huh. Internet! Yeah, we call them uh, Zwarte Piet, which means, well, blackface. So, uh, <laughs> oh God, what are you these, are, me? <laughs> these are the pictures. Oh. It's really sad. It makes me sad just because, you know, the connotations of blackface. And I don't know, maybe if it's like a, a true. Well, I don't know. Because it could be a cultural tradition that has a different meaning and that, like, the people from America, like, took from that and, like, did blackface. And so I don't know, like, maybe I would have to do more research on it, but, like, the initial reaction is, like, it makes me really sad to see that. <laughs> yeah, tell me, why, why does it make you um, sad? I think just because of the history with blackface and like the vaudeville shows and you know the caricatures of black people and like those performances and like how it was just, like really playing into like, it was playing into the idea that black people were kind of like buffoons or like you know like really this, these just like, I don't know, just caricatures of themselves and like that, like, and that was like the way for like some black people, like even the black performers that did blackface to be accepted, you know, to make the white people laugh to entertain them. And, you know, there are white people that still do blackface, and, you know, especially like, if they want to be black characters. And, like, I don't, it's just, I don't know. I just feel like blackface is just like never, like, just if you ever think about doing blackface, just don't do it. Like, if you're not black, like, don't, like, you you hate on us, you despise our race, but then you paint your face black to celebrate something and, you know, to look like us, but, like, yeah, you, you despise us and you tan your skin to get a darker, nicer color, but, like, a person that naturally has melanin, like, you know, pigmentation in their skin and has melanin, but you, you don't like us because of that, you know, you base it on our race because of our color, and then you paint your face black and you know yeah or get a tan so there's also uh <laughs> the song uh like very cute children's song yeah. saying uh, uh even though i'm black this is the black face mm -hmm. i mean i have good intentions tell us how when i saw those good men and all good like how do you I think that like makes up for a little bit <laughs> just because like even though because it is like you know even though I'm black I have good intentions I like that because it's just like you know like the I actually I'm um, started to read this Toni Morrison um, novel or not a novel but it, I don't know what it is actually but um, it's about it's called playing in the dark whiteness in the literary imagination I just read the opening and like the forward and it was just like how about like the language that we use and like in literature to like describe like whiteness and blackness and like how like black is like associated with dark and evil and white is associated with like purity and light and all those different things like the good things so you know like these like even the language that we used to describe like you know the colors of black versus white like it just um, it like perpetuates you know the ideals of like you know how blackness or so if you run into a person that's darker it's like they're scary or menacing because of like these descriptions that are used in our literature to describe like not just black people but the color black in general you know yeah so i turn off the phone a bit wow so what do you think about this um definitely don't think that's right 
Yeah. Yeah. It's very offensive. So why is it uh, offensive, you say? Yeah. I mean, I find it kind of ridiculous because it's just, you know, we eat the same food, we get hungry at the same time, we all sleep, it's not no different. So it's saying something like that. It's negativity, I suppose. Yeah, it's actually also a direct reference to slavery. Yeah, actually, yeah. Yeah, and some people who defend this. What do you think about this? This hardware of Santa Claus. I mean, oh, what do we think? What do you think about it? Yeah, I think it brings us back to like some slavery shit. You feel know I me? Mean? You know, it's like that, that's what it reminds me of. I don't think nothing of it. It's a real problem going on. Look damn good though. Interesting. Your perspective is interesting because uh, some other people that we spoke to were very offended. Even some white people we spoke to were very offended. So it's interesting that you said that, you know, there's bigger issues out there um, than this. Right. I, I mean, Betty that's, Boo is that's, white now, right? That's so what they do to you show know, me Betty Boo too. Keep our mind open for the bigger picture. Interesting. Now, right? so you know, they give us like things that. like this because they know we're going to cry. Hey, especially Trump black is people. in power, guys. Because the post. Dramatic slave syndrome. Right. So you think that this is a tool for re-traumatizing black right. people? And you know, not letting them educate themselves on what's right. Right. They're too busy trying to find out who's the Illuminati. Right. When's the world gonna end? Too much controversy going on. You know what I mean? So people need to just start paying attention to what's really right. at hand. To what really matters. Like Economics and finance and real estate. Yeah. Better yeah. Our yeah. black Equality. people. Yeah. yeah. Equality is because you know you got white people that's fucked up too. Yeah. So yeah. Equality is more of like let's get our money up. It's economics. Yeah, it's economics, man. Right. You see it. Yeah. That's an interesting okay. point. So do you so think racism mm -hmm. could be a division strategy? Racism will never, will never, would yeah. never, ever, ever yeah. end. Racism is not even really the word. The, the, to define that word is not even the real definition that they're putting. Like somebody's prejudice against another. It's just basically, it's a good, it's like, it's just like when the Bible told every nation to stick with each nation. It wasn't because it was being racist. It was basically because it's like, all right, when you're splicing genes, it's like, it's like breeding two different plants. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And you create a hybrid plant. You know what I'm saying? Something that's not authentic. You know what I mean? So when you splicing the genes, you know, fucking the, the DNA pool up, man. Right. You know, right. But, you know, and his name is Blackface, Blackface. What do you think about it? It's really weird. Why it's weird? And that would never happen here in New York. Right. Why wouldn't it happen here? Because it's too offensive. It's offensive. Yeah. Right. So, Interesting. Here you go, guys. The whole store is on sale today. Thank you. So, why do you think it's offensive? That they painted like this black. I think no one does that anymore. Like a really old school thing. Yes, that's exactly the discussion. If right I saw that today, I would say something 100%. Okay. What would you say? I would say that's not right. And then the person who's doing it, I would ask them why they were doing that. Yeah, exactly. So that's a discussion right now. There are protests against this. And that's a real thing. Uh, it's real. It's, it's, it's no it's, joke. It's no joke. It's on television and billboards in the Netherlands. And this relates to children. Black faces holding children like, ah, I'm bringing you a present, and you have to be sweet, and... <laughs> it's really odd. So, yeah, there's a discussion. It's 2016. <laughs> yeah, exactly, that's the discussion right now, like, this is not from our time. Right. This is referring to slavery. Right. So, yeah, there's a lot of discussion right now, that's why I'm also asking people in America about their opinion. Oh, so, yeah, that would never happen here. Like, uh... <laughs> that would not happen in New York. Yeah. Yeah, so there's a lot of disagreement. There's a one large group of Dutch people who are against it, like yeah. protesting against it and saying we are a progressive country. Well, I hope they get away with And that. then there's another group of people, probably those who would have voted Trump here, who yeah. say this is our tradition and uh, keep away from our traditions. And well, I hope the protesters have success. All right, yeah. Yes, it's not right. Yeah. I'm gonna look okay. that up when I go yeah. home tonight. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> sure, that it's not a joke. <laughs> yeah. 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 My heart like sunk when you showed me that picture. I was like, yeah. Wow. <laughs>
Nou, is er is wel eens een moment dat jij je schaamt dat je Nederlander bent. Ja, met Sinterklaas. Nou ja. Ja, sorry. Maar, ja wat, dat wat vind het? ik echt. Want? Nou, ik vind dat die Zwarte Pieter, dat kan echt niet meer, toch? Oh. Ja, bonk is al doodsbonk. Dat, we... dat vindt u. Vindt u kan Zwarte Piet, kan dat nog eigenlijk? Ja, dat kan nog. Ja. Maar leg dat maar eens uit ja. aan iemand uit Jamaica. Een neger uit Jamaica. Ja, ik weet ik heb het geprobeerd. Ik kom er wel eens. Ja, en? maar ja, hoe is dat dan om dat uit te leggen? Want ja, dat, dat is traditie. Hele ja, maar... oude tradities. En zij hebben hun eigen hele oude tradities. Ik vind dat toch niet zo erg. Right. I do hate the wicked motherfucking Carnegie's and the Bilderbergs and the fucking Central Bank motherfuckers who's been misleading the people for centuries. Yep. These families. Yep. Those motherfuckers are gonna burn in hell. Those motherfuckers who the creator is gonna get. Right? <laughs> from America, this is a very racist place. So, I mean, obviously it wasn't feelings of joy. Uh, I don't know. I mean, once you go through a couple of things, it's just, it is what it is. It's just the way it was. Are you surprised that that's something that's so no, 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 no. prevalent I, I, in the in the place like the Netherlands? I feel like I've actually heard of that before. Yeah? Yeah. Like heard when, before? Yeah. About this uh, tradition? Yeah. yeah. What do yeah. you think well, about it? Actually, that is very, very new to me right now. I mean, raising a little girl, moving her, and I've never seen that. I've seen blackface. Right. But I didn't think of it that type of thing. I guess reached out there. Like, I don't know if it was from over in the Netherlands, I was from over here, or it was from over here. Like, right. Know. 2016. <laughs> Actually, there's a lot of discussion going on right now. There's a lot of protest against this because people say it's yeah. offensive. And at the same time, there are angry people saying, this is our tradition. Go somewhere else if you don't like it. And I really like the, almost finally defending this 